All right. Hey, everyone. Happy Derby. I am Casey Gray, the Finlandia brand ambassador, and I'm here to celebrate all things Kentucky Oaks with you as we get ready for the big weekend of races ahead of us. Uh, so today I'm here to talk about Finlandia vodka, the official vodka of the Kentucky Derby. And I'm here to show you how to make the official cocktail of Oaks Day, the Finlandia Oaks Lily. So I'm going to dive in and show you guys how to make this really simple three ingredient recipe at home um, or four ingredients, excuse me, with the Finlandia vodka. And of course, we'll start with our original Finlandia vodka. Like I said, the official vodka of the Kentucky Derby. We we'll use about one and a quarter ounce of that. And then we will add about one ounce of sweet and sour. Just a quarter ounce of triple sec. And then we'll top it off with three ounces of cranberry juice. And this is what is going to give the lily that beautiful pink color that it's known for. Uh, it was actually created as a way to emulate the stargazer lilies that are draped over the winning Oaks race horse. And then we'll just add a simple garnish of a lemon peel and a blackberry and you have the Finlandia Oaks Lily. So this will be available all weekend long at Churchill Downs if you're lucky enough to make it to the track, but it's also so easy to make at home as you can see. Um, so I hope that you enjoy these throughout your derby parties. Um, but maybe if this really sweet cocktail isn't for you, I actually have another alternative called the Finish Line, which is a newer cocktail from uh, Finlandia for derby weekend. Another drink that'll be served all weekend at the track and another really easy one to make at home, only two ingredients. So it really doesn't get any easier than that. So for this cocktail, we are using the Finlandia Grapefruit Vodka. It's one of Finlandia's two flavors. And we will use, again, one and a quarter ounce. And then we're just going to top it off with tonic water. Um, or what I really like about this cocktail is you kind of can mess around with it and make it customized to your flavor. So I like to use maybe a citrus soda water or any kind of sparkling water in this cocktail. Um, you'll add a little straw and then you'll garnish with a slice of fresh grapefruit and you have the finish line. So like I said, does not get any easier than this. Um, hope you guys really enjoy these cocktails at home and have a wonderful Oaks and Derby weekend.